Hey people, what's up? Good afternoon. How you doing? Hope you guys did not see rain. It has been raining cat and dog for like three days, but I love the weather. So welcome to another vlog. Um, if this is your first time of seeing me as usual, my name is Busai Ogunlaja and I'm a YouTuber based in Lagos, Nigeria. I do lifestyle content. I show you beautiful places in Lagos, tourist attractions. I also take you to the market and you know find out the current prices of food stops and grocery for that month. And I do interviews of successful people or just very interesting topics. Okay. <laughs> Alright, so today i'm currently um at leisure muscle area and that's because i want to go to spa which is i don't know if spa is affordable or expensive i don't know what, what to qualify it but i know it's not too expensive and it's not too cheap so i think it's kind of in the middle but it's very big and this is not where i normally shop but you know i just decided to do big girl today but I have a limited budget. I have a budget of 30,000 Naira. I don't want to go beyond that. And I want to buy the essential things for a family of four. That includes provisions, um, little foodstuffs here and there. So let's, you know, let's go on this um, adventure. Let's see how many food items 30,000 Naira can get me. Today is, um, we're in June. This is the end of June. So June 2022. How much can 30,000 naira buy me in terms of groceries? So let's go!
Sal. The next day. Hey guys, so this is the next day. Sorry I wasn't able to show you guys what I got uh, yesterday, but now I'm pumped. I have strength and I can show you guys. <laughs> this is it. <laughs> it's so long. Oh my god. So I'm really ashamed. I don't know what to say right now because I went to the budget of 30,000 naira, but I ended up spending more than that which I'm going to be revealing at the end of this video. So please stick around to know how much I eventually spent. <laughs> I don't know, everything was just calling me like, buy me, buy me, buy me, like, look at this. Look at this thing like this. It's like a plate for kids. I've opened it already because I've started using it immediately. But this is no grocery, I bought it. <laughs> and it was just calling me, it's made by this brand called the Mobi. And it, isn't it cute? It's, it's, it's pink in color. That's why I picked it. So let's quickly do a run through of all the things I got. Guys, so first on my list is this chicken fangs for 918 naira. Oh my god, this thing used to be. I remember when I used to really, you know, regularly buy it. So it was no more than 500 naira. But now it goes for 918 naira. Inflation has really gotten a hold on Nigeria. <laughs> Where are we going? Then I bought this chicken shower mat. Uh, I can't show you guys because uh, this is the next day. But if you watch the video when I was buying it in spa, you would see the chicken shower mat. And I got it for 1400 The next I bought Milo. I bought Milo for 1315 naira. So this is the size that goes for 1350 naira and i bought two of them so i have one and this is the this is the second one so i got a promo for this i got recharge card 200 naira for buying this uh, milo this set of milo so it's something that if you go to spa you can ask for your recharge card once you buy uh, milo or godimo they are giving 200 naira recharge card which i've loaded and it's helpful <laughs> okay so the next thing on my list is a set of apple i bought i got the apple for 813 naira let me look for where the apple is okay this is it so i got the set of apple for 813 naira is a set of six 
and i just love it they are really cute they are you know very red reddish in color and that's so nice so you can buy one but you don't have to buy this set but i wanted this set so that i can you know eat more apples and make my heart healthy <laughs> Next, I got Savlon for um, disinfecting my toilet, my bedroom, and everything. And this Savlon goes for 540 naira for one. I also got the Apic, Apic for disinfecting the toilet also. And this is 1016 naira. So Apic has different variants and different sizes. But this one goes for 1016 naira. Next thing I got was um, Nestle Golden More, and uh, this is the big size. One went for 1740 naira. Oh my god, that's a lot <laughs> considering how um, you know my children will just consume this in um, two weeks. This Golden More is going to be gone, and I got two, so that made a total of. Um, how much is that again? 3,418 naira. Bread is very essential in my family life. There's no shopping I go for. I always like to buy bread. So I bought this um, spa bread and the bread goes for 600 naira, which is you know, quite affordable considering the increase in um, bread nowadays. I, I was on Twitter recently and I saw that there's a particular bread, though imported from outside the country, that went for 7,500. Like, <laughs> oh my god, why would I buy bread for 7,500? <laughs> so, please let me know in the comment section. Can you actually buy a bread that goes for 7,500? Like, what special thing will make you, make you buy a bread that costs 7,500? Now every Nigerian home should always have this effect dance because because of mosquitoes. But thank God the rainy seasons are here, and I don't think we are seeing a lot of uh, mosquitoes. But it's always good to have this in your house. So I usually buy the Mega Saver Morten Instant, the Lemon Fragrance. So I really like this because when you spray it, it's not the scent is not choking. It gives that lemon fragrance, and yes, it works. It kills them. Um, the mosquitoes i also bought um vegetable oil mamado i usually go for grand oil. when i saw the price of grand oil like oh my god grand oil was going up for about five thousand seven or so so i got this mamado which is cheaper mamado is four thousand seven hundred for this um this is 2.5 liter it's not even five liter <laughs> okay and this goes for four thousand seven hundred then I got Indomie. Indomie. I bought a carton of Indomie for 4200 I don't think this was a good buy because we obviously were calculating the Indomie per pack. So what I can see in my receipt here, I'm seeing 105 Naira times 40. So that's how they arrived at 4200 but i'm buying a pack so i was supposed to get some discount so at least get uh, not get it at the regular price of per one so that's why i was saying don't buy packs from spa no it's supposed to be cheaper than that at least i'm supposed to get it for like 400 naira a 4000 naira rather what if i wanted to sell it so will i also sell it at a retail price no i'm getting a pack so it should be cheaper so that's what i feel but let me know what you think in the comment section this is supposed to be cheaper by the pack yes or no <laughs> okay so next thing i got i got some a, a pair of um, tissue paper and uh, this goes for 205 naira my familia my familia rather that's the brand of the tissue paper i always see the advert on tv uh, this is my first time of buying it does it really matter? I think all tissue paper are the same, at least they do the same thing. But yeah. there's nothing wrong in trying this. Uh, let's see. Then I have Dangote sugar. Dangote is my go to brand for sugar, spaghetti, basically anything that Dangote makes. I don't know, I just trust them. And so this Dangote sugar is my go to. And Dangote sugar, this size goes for 415 naira. Then I have Geba. Geba oats milk since i started using this um this 
cereal for my kids i don't know i've not just looked back this is what i will use for all my children and so this is what my my last born is currently um, taking and this is the oatmeal single grain cereal and this goes for 4950 naira wow almost 5000 naira you can see that these children are the one chopping on my money hey god <laughs> Okay, then we move on to Titus. Titus, <laughs> guys, Titus is now five hundred and twenty naira. <laughs> so there was a debate I saw on Twitter where people were like, "There are different brands of Titus now of Sandin. Titus is the original one that we know, but there are now different variations at different prices." Someone was saying that Titus is now one thousand naira. Lo and build in spa, Titus is just 520 naira, which is still a lot. This oats and milk biscuit is gradually becoming my favorite biscuit. Like, I just love the taste. I love that it has a lot of fiber and all. But spa has cheated me because on my receipt, I'm seeing that I bought one for 130 naira. Like, who does that? This biscuit goes for 15 naira in the Malam in my area. I'm so sure about that. I said the price has gone up. I'm sure it hasn't gone up to 130 naira. So, Spam billed me 130 naira for one. And I go for that 520 naira. Oh my god. <laughs> I need to be checking the prices well before I pick things. I also got this um, biscuit, the Magritte's old biscuit. My kids have actually eaten one. And on the receipt, I'm seeing 110 naira. Which is also a lot. This biscuit should not be more than 15 naira. What do you think in the comment section? How much do you they sell these biscuits in your area, please? Am I the one <laughs> misunderstanding or misinterpreting something? Yeah, something is going wrong. This biscuit should not be more than 15 naira. The next thing I bought is the Dano Cow milk. I always buy the futures to save money, seeing that I already have a lot of things at home. And this went for 3,305 naira. Hmm. Good buy or not? I don't even know what to say about this. <laughs> okay. You know, my love for fried rice. I'm taking fried rice any day. So I, always, I already got my fried rice ingredients. I have this um, Maro Fat Processed Beef, the brand Sun Pry. And I got this for 505 naira okay okay 505 naira not bad not bad okay now because i want my kids to grow healthy i always get them this pick one two three they said it's specially designed for their age and it has some nutrients that you know they specifically need for their age so i got this for 2415 naira i didn't get the refill if not i could have gotten a refill because i have a lot of things at home i could just easily pour into but you know that's fine um, the next thing will be this plate, this beautiful plate that I was so tempted to buy. <laughs> so why I like the plate is that it has this um, suction on the on the bottom. So when you place it on a table, it sticks. It's like for children that move things around, you know, they move the plates all around, so it will just stick. And like I said, it's from this brand called Moby, but this is quite expensive. I got this for 3235 naira. I just wanted to buy two, but when I saw the price, hey, I just said, let me buy one first. And I'm just going to go with one for now. What is becoming my new favorite breakfast? I just take it with fruits and I'm ready for the day. So I got this Quaker Hot Refill for 1,175 Naira. This is like the original Quaker brand, so I think it's a good buy. Then lastly, I have this uh, Rice Cripsy for 1,230 Naira. Rice Cripsy for my kids. And you know, that's all. That's all the things I got. Hey guys, so this is Revelation time. I know I said I wanted to spend 30,000 naira, but this is what I ended up spending. I spent 42,625 naira. <laughs> 
Oh god, Nigeria just happened to me like ah what's the sense of planning and budget if you stick over budget? So let me know in the comments say, are you like me? Do you plan for something and then you see another thing and you buy it or are you strict? Are you strict to to choose what you only want to buy? <laughs> Alright guys, thank you so much for watching this video. Kindly do this following subscribe to my channel like this video and share the video with your family and friends and i'll see you in my next video bye for now bye